You know, Alan, it's one of the simplest safety rules we teach our children. Don't open the door for strangers. And yet, despite one family's best attempts, it happened this weekend. Now, as police investigate, we sat down with the child. Well, the day after Joe Biden's State of the Union address, which is by far the most clever State of the Union address ever delivered. And if you predicted that the oldest... For two days, the nation was paralyzed by an existential crisis the likes of which this country has never seen, a crisis so dire it threatened our institutions, our political system, our very way of life, a waking nightmare. President Biden is continuing to hammer Florida Senator Rick Scott and his proposal to sunset all federal legislation after five years, including Medicare and Social Security, unless Congress decided to reauthorize it. Tonight, after a horrifying act at a Quebec daycare, a grieving community comes together. For the parents who lost their kids yeah. and the parents that the kids are still at the hospital. Yes. We pray for them. We've got Andrew Tate's ex exposing how he recruited victims in newly obtained messages and voice notes. Hogwarts legacy has divided and set the internet on fire. Why people are shouting scam as hundreds of thousands of dollars are being raised for Turkey earthquake victims. We have some new information developments on that suspected Chinese spy balloon. Commanders at NORAD say they do not believe that a second spy device actually flew over North America. The general in charge. Why is he no longer in Brooklyn? Hey, Greeny, uh, I think the biggest reason Kevin Durant's no longer in Brooklyn is that he didn't want to be in Brooklyn anymore. He wanted to be in Phoenix. This is women in this country still make 77 cents on the dollar for what men make. So if yeah, exactly. women don't make less than men? Actually, if you start looking at the numbers, Rachel, uh, there are lots of reasons for that. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait.